Honestly, the best finale wow. showdown ever. Chris and I were standing backstage before the show started tonight. We both kind of went, can you believe this? I mean, this is, like, huge. And he said to me, yeah, I'm just trying to make sure I can remember this later. Like, I'm just trying to stay present. Mm -hmm. He was, um... He was really supportive this whole time, and, and, and uh, I'm glad it was him and I in the end. Oh, I'm talking about you. I'm talking about you. Yeah. Yeah. Are you like? Are you dizzy? Dizzy tired? During the day, we had some, some moments where we looked at each other and be like, what do you think is going to happen? And uh, it was really cool because we both, at various times, just stopped and looked at each other and meant, you know what, whatever happens, you're cool in my book and, you know, I'll be your friend for life and you deserve it. So it felt great. I, I think Chris is so talented and so deserving of that title and it was an honor standing next to him. It really is the truth. You guys are, are really good friends. How, how have you supported one another throughout this whole process? You know, since we've been... Since we've been in group two together in the top 36, you know, uh, we've helped out song choices, um, arrangements, and all that kind of stuff. And he's he's uh, bounced ideas off of me, and I've bounced ideas off of him. And and uh, and it's been really nice to have that kind of person to to do that kind of stuff. Yeah. The new American Idol is Chris. Uh. I, think, I think I shook you like yeah. that a couple of times because you were like, I don't know the thing. I think my mouth was like, Yeah, you you, you yeah, yeah. You were shocked, and then I was like. You did it! Okay, and you gotta it. sing that song! <laughs> <laughs> so, so, you, know. you know, I mean, Chris and I kept talking about it the last couple of days, and we realized it was going to be anyone's game. We're both big fans of each other, and, and we both felt like getting to the finals was winning in itself, you know? It wasn't about who's going to beat each other out, it wasn't a fight, it was just a celebration. And we, I, I, I really feel like we did that tonight. Um, I'm still shocked um, to go get up against someone like Adam. We're really good friends, and... Uh, and we've just created this bond, and we're just really close. And that was tough to go up against him, but more than anything, we weren't competing. We were just uh, we were just having a good time. I think he's an incredible artist. I think he's a really deserving guy. Um, he's got an incredible heart. Him and his wife have an inspiring relationship. Inspiring, really. I mean, they they make me kind of go, oh, okay, that's that's the real deal. That's what I'm striving for. And, and I hope that that's what me and Adam's friendship has shown people, that no matter how different you are, that you can still love people and be friends with them. Will you stay in touch with them text-wise? Oh, my gosh, yeah. Email? I mean, we'll have a great time. I mean, we're going to be on tour together, so and we'll, be, we'll have a blast during that time. You guys always came off like you really, truly adored each other, too, uh -huh. and were yeah. for each other. Is that a real friendship yeah. between you I mean, two? we were roommates, and we both had... <laughs> <laughs> Great, thanks. Oh, I didn't yeah. know so you were roommates, roommates. too. Oh, yeah, okay. Seriously. We were so roommates. you really get to know a guy when you're sharing a bathroom. Yeah. Exactly. Come on. Yeah. Luckily, we had two different sinks, because I think I would have drove him nuts with all my product and whatnot. <laughs> Nail polish product. and I know. hairspray. Well, let me see your nails. Um, I don't, I don't care. I, am, I like I the don't. top. <laughs> that, That's inappropriate. That was good. That was good. Hey. Hello, everyone. I'm here with Adam Lambert. <laughs> How are you doing today, Adam? I'm well, thank you, sir. That's very good. <laughs> so, my first question. Everyone has been talking about what you're going to wear on tour. And I like your announcer voice. I your, your am. Reporter voice I, is good. It's good. Yeah, I know. it's really, Thank really wonderful. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> and now, I was joking. They gave you a feather, didn't they? They gave me a couple feathers. They wanted to um, glam up my look a little bit, which I, I really appreciate. Thanks. And they also gave me a headphone splitter so that me and Adam can listen to music after these shows and cuddle. They're clearly misinterpreting our friendship. <laughs> Crush is a very non-threatening thing, I think. Yeah. I know. Crush on Adam. Can I say that? I have a crush on you, Adam. I'll run with that. Now I everything... Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. Screw I'm screwed. Yeah, there we go. For six weeks in a row, that's the Black Eyed Peas at number one with Boom Boom Pow. My name is Adam Lambert. 
And my name is Chris Allen. <laughs> this is Adam Lambert from American Idol, guest hosting with Chris Allen while C. Chris is out. We're almost out of here, too, but before we go, the producers really want to put me on the spot. Hey, this is Jennifer from Indiana. I had a question for Chris Allen. Uh, in Adam's Rolling Stone interview, he admitted to having a crush on you. Uh, how did you feel about that? Yeah, Chris, how'd you feel about that? Stop yelling at me. Did it make you embarrassed? Well, Jennifer, I have addressed this. No, it didn't make me embarrassed at all. The funny thing was, like, Adam texted me when it came out, and he said, I'm so embarrassed. And I was like, whatever. <laughs> or not. It's <laughs> bull crap. Uh, I kind of, you know, I kind of regretted being that open and honest with the uh, reporter. But, you know. No, you didn't. Now I do. No, why? Now that it's like because everybody's asking about it. And it's, we don't care. Don't we care. don't care. It's not, you guys, a crush doesn't mean that I was having, you know, Anyway, a crush is very <laughs> a crush is a very very nice lightweight exactly. thing. Exactly, it's not a big deal. I have a crush on you, Adam. How about that? See, wow, you heard it here first. Yeah, <laughs> starting some new rumors on American Dad. I'm trying to mix things up. Exactly. <laughs> All right, so you guys asked for it. You wanted a kratom bubble tweet. So here we are on the bus, headed to New York City. New York City. <laughs> Uh, we'll see you guys at the concerts this week, and um, I'm a little tired myself. Yeah, let's go to bed in a bill. Who's on top? Oh. Yeah, you just did that. Yeah. <laughs> hi, everybody. Say hi to Kratom. Hi. Ask a question, and this is to Kratom. How long does it take you to do your hair, and do you do it yourself? Well, um, yeah, no, I, I, do, I do do it myself. Um, I don't know, it takes a couple minutes, I don't know. It depends on the do, right? It depends on the do, yeah. If he's got the, the thing the, going. The pompadour is a lot more involved. That takes a while. There's like blow dryers and back combing. He usually needs help with that. Yeah. Yeah, Chris actually has become, you know, I've we were roommates, so he would, you know, help I've me. I've done things. Yeah, he was really, yeah. I introduced him to a whole new world of products. This is true. I've seen things I've never seen before. I was, like, in the back while he wasn't there, like, trying to. I was like, what did this do? <laughs> oh, it turns your hair blue, okay. <laughs> what about your former, uh... Uh, competitor, I guess I should say. Yeah, what do you think of what do you think makes him sexy? Uh, he's comfortable in his own skin as well. Yeah. Not really. Yeah. <laughs> it's a funny, it's 100 single ball. Here you are reunited with Chris Allen. I know. There he is. It there he is. That, right there playing right hey, now. Hey, Chris, what's up? And I know you actually wanted to hurry up with this interview so you could go back and see his last couple songs and stuff. Oh, I'm so excited for him. Make sure you catch us on tour. Until then, we are out of here.